डॉक्टर साधना सिंह एसोसिएट प्रोफेसर इन केमिस्ट्री एस एम बी गवर्नमेंट कॉलेज नाथद्वारा नाउ टूडे वी स्टडी सिंथेसिस ऑफ नेपथलीन इट कैन फाउंड इन कोल्टार एंड लिटिल अमाउंट इन पेट्रोलियम द मिडिल फ्रैक्शन ऑफ कोल्टार कंटेन नियर अबाउट नाइन परसेंट नेपथलीन विच ऑन वॉशिंग विद हॉट वाटर सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड एंड एनवेज द इम्प्योरिटीज आर रिमूवड एंड वी गेट दी प्योर नेपथलीन द पेट्रोलियम डिस्टिलेट ऑल्सो बाई हीटिंग एट सिक्स एटी डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड गिवस नेपथलीन एंड मिथाइल नेपथलीन द मिथाइल नेपथलीन आफ्टर डी मिथाइलेशन गिव दी नेपथलीन सो फ्रॉम दीज वी कैन ऑप्टेन डायरेक्ट directly the naphthalene and the synthesis of naphthalene are like r number 1 is with 4 phenyl but 1n the compound 4 phenyl 1 butene when passed over heated calcium oxide the two molecules of hydrogen are removed and we get the naphthalene the other method is with 4 phenyl but 3 enoic acid this 4 phenyl 3 butanoic acid when react with sulfuric acid it remove water molecule and we get the alpha naphthol these are the isomer of alpha naphthol the alpha naphthol on heated with zinc dust if the naphthalene and zinc oxide is also obtained the next method is beer and perkin synthesis in beer and perkin synthesis the 1 2di bromomethyl benzene react with sodium salt of succinic ester the nabr two molecules of nabr are removed and we get the tetra ester compound this tetra ester the cyclization take place and we get the tetra ester compound this tetra ester compound on hydrolysis convert into the tetra carboxylic compound this tetra carboxylic compound when passed with soda lime heated with soda lime the co2 gas is evolved and we get the tetrahydronephthalene this tetrahydronephthalene when passed with palladium and carbon the hydrogen molecules are removed that is dehydrogenation take place and we get the naphthalene the next synthesis is howard synthesis in howard synthesis benzene react with succinic anhydride in the presence of aluminum chloride the the bond breaks break from here and we get the this ketonic acid this ketonic acid on reduction with hcl in the presence of zinc and mercury that is clemenson reduction the co group is reduced to the ch2 group and we get the carboxylic compound this carboxylic compound this 4 methyl butanoic acid is when react with sulfuric acid it eliminate water molecule from here one hydrogen from benzene ring and oh of carboxylic group and we get the cyclic compound tetralone this cyclic compound tetralone again reduced with hcl in the presence of zinc and mercury that is clemenson reduction the co group converts into the ch2 group and we get the tetrahydronephthalene this tetrahydronephthalene in the presence of palladium and carbon it removes hydrogen atoms and we get the naphthalene the last synthesis is known as the 
bits synthesis in this betatalone which undergoes keto enol tautomerization to give this enolic compound which has isomer this is 1 2 this is 3 4 isomer this tetralone in the presence of qh and nh that is in the presence of oh minus remove the proton and after the removal of proton oh minus is also removed that is water is removed and from tetralone we get the naphthalene this is the bits synthesis so these are the synthesis of naphthalene now we study the properties of naphthalene the physical property of naphthalene we all know that we have seen naphthalene in our in our house and we know that it is a white solid with melting point 80 degree centigrade and by heating it easily sublime it is insoluble in water but soluble in organic solvents like alcohol ether benzene etc about chemical properties of naphthalene we know it is an aromatic compound so it undergoes electrophilic substitution reactions with this it gives some addition reactions and some oxidation reactions also if we see the addition reactions of naphthalene then there are four reactions the reaction with hydrogen that is the reduction of naphthalene reaction with halogen reaction with sodium and also it react with ozone first we see the addition reaction with hydrogen that is the reduction of naphthalene the naphthalene with hydrogen in the presence of sodium and ethyl alcohol gives 1,4 diene or 1,2 diene that is its one double bond is reduced and we get the 1,4 or 1,2 diene with sodium and acyl isoamyl alcohol two molecules of hydrogen react with naphthalene and we get the tetraline with hydrogen in the presence of nickel at 150 degree centigrade again we get the tetraline and this tetraline with again reduced with hydrogen three molecules of hydrogen in the presence of nickel at 200 degree centigrade all the double bonds are reduced by hydrogen and we get the saturated compound that is decaline next the reaction addition reaction of naphthalene with halogen naphthalene also react with halogen just like naphthalene react with chlorine to give naphthalene dichloride a chlorine molecule is attached on a double bond and we get the naphthalene dichloride this naphthalene dichloride if it react with another cl2 molecule then it attach with the another double bond and we get the naphthalene tetrachlorine this naphthalene dichloride or naphthalene tetrachloride when oxidized the ring on which chlorine atoms are present is reactive and it is broken and we get the phthalic acid if naphthalene dichloride is heated at 40 degree centigrade then it eliminate an h and cl from another carbon and we get the hcl is removed and we get the one chloronephthalene and if tetra chloronephthalene is heated with noh then two molecules of hcl 
are removed here from H and CL here from H and CL that is two molecules of HCl are removed and we get the 1 and 3 dichloronephthalene. Naphthalene also react with sodium element and with sodium element it gives the ionic salt. The sodium has one lone pair of electron, unpaired electron. Sorry, it has one unpaired electron. It gives to the naphthalene and we get this ionic salt. The structure of ionic salt are equivalent to this one. They have they are little stabilized due to the resonating structure and the resonating structures are like this. N A plus here the bond one bro double bond is broken and one hydrogen has elect uh, ex um, unpaired electron and one has two unpaired electrons so it has negative charge here this hydrogen atom has negative charge here this hydrogen atom has negative charge and so we have the resonating structure which is stabilized this ionic structure of naphthalene with sodium the another addition reaction is the addition of naphthalene with ozone the naphthalene react with two molecules of ozone to give the addition compound diozonide this is two molecules are attached on the two double bonds of naphthalene this diozonide when hydrolyzed with water in the presence of zinc it is this ring is oxidized and we get the thalaldehyde so with ozone we get, di we get diozonide this on hydrolysis we get thalaldehyde so these are the addition reactions of naphthalene next we will study the oxidation and electrophilic substitution reaction of naphthalene thank you